Hello. PCCL channel greets you. In order to balance the chemical equation, you need to make sure that there are as many atoms of each element, before and after. This is the principle of mass conservation. For the first, two hydrogen atoms before, in molecular hydrogen. They go in pairs. We have no choice. Hydrogen gas is like that. Two atoms held together. Molecular oxygen, two atoms together. The element hydrogen is found twice here, there is no problem, but there is only one oxygen. When there is nothing in chemistry, it's one. Since there is only one, I feel like putting a two here to balance. In doing so, I unbalance the hydrogen since in the water molecule there are two. If I evoke two water molecules that would be four now, so I have to balance here. Here I do not put anything. In chemistry, nothing is one, I said that. I check. Is this consistent? To burn, two molecules of hydrogen will need one molecule of oxygen and two molecules of water will be produced. Thus the law of mass conservation is observed. These are the two water molecules. I start again. You see here it's hydrogen. There it's oxygen. And then these molecules are gone, but not the atoms. They are still there to form two water molecules. Molecular nitrogen N2. N is the nitrogen atom. Nitrogen and hydrogen react to form ammonia. Can it be done that way? Two here while there is only one on the right. So we multiply here by 2 that there are 2 nitrogen atoms. So 2 times 3 equals 6. Means that here you have to do 3 times 2. It would be balanced. I check. Indeed, here are the 3 hydrogen molecules. Here there is a single nitrogen molecule and when they meet they will react. The atoms are still there but they have combined to form ammonia molecules. Here, the chemical reaction is already balanced. There is nothing to do. C plus O2 yields CO2. Here is the CO2 here. Linear molecule with carbon in the middle. And the last. C plus O2 yields CO. One carbon. One carbon there too. Oxygen. Two on the left and one on the right. I cannot put the two after. The carbon monoxide molecule is what it is, I am not going to modify it to balance, we do not touch the molecules to balance, we can only modify the coefficients. So here, I balance the oxygen, but in doing so, I unbalance the carbon. I must come back to something that seemed to me to be taken for granted. As soon as we have placed a coefficient we check that we have not modified anything else. Is that possible? Yes. These are two carbon atoms that will react to yield this toxic gas. Carbon monoxide. That's it for this video. Thank you.